That's here, stand by for the last. And away they go in the last at Seoul. The slowest out there was Aroma. At the right end of the field, Cupid Warrior away very nicely. Port Suwon can be right on pace with Desem Manse. Baname Yankee is prominent as well as his green back from the far side. Victory hit one Pyong Killer. They're wide, but they're looking to get forward. Ending fire, the red cap just leading a couple, those being Aroma. And right at the back of the field, uh, we find uh, Super Gun Huang. So, a three and a half to go in the last. Cupid Warrior it is who leads. Greenback just up on the outside of Balame Hyangi there in second and third. Then came victory hit, puts him onto the fence. One Pion Killer out wide, followed by ending fire. A length and a half more to Dese Manse in company with Tukgubdero. And then it is Aroma with Super Gun Huang continuing to trail. Top of the straight in the last is Cupid Warrior up the inside. Has found the lead. From Greenback between the pair of those comes Balame Hyangi. Down the outside will be victory hit, one Pion Killer. Ending fire, the favorite, is a good seven, eight lengths off it as we come to the 300. And it's Cupid Warrior who can continues to lead the lead up to about three and a half lengths now on Balame Yangi. But here come flashing down the outside at, at speed is Tukgubdero. Tukgubdero now ending fire going through the gears. It is Tukgubdero over the top of Cupid Warrior to win it. Tukgubdero from Cupid Warrior and ending fire in third. Tukgubdero, Lee Hyuk for trainer Lee Hee Young and owner Kim Kun Young. And this four-year-old filly, she's by Yonsung Darrow. Start number 10, it's win number three.